We are about to embark on a journey to learn what a totem pole is and its cultural significance. Totem poles are tall wooden posts carved and painted with symbols or figures. These poles are an important part of the indigenous cultures in the Pacific Northwest region of North America. Each totem pole tells a story representing family lineage, important events or cultural beliefs. The figures on the poles are often animals, humans or supernatural beings from indigenous mythologies. These figures are usually arranged in a stack with each figure placed one on top of the other. The figure at the bottom of the pole is typically the most important and tells the primary story. Different indigenous groups may have distinct styles and meanings for their totem poles. Some poles are known as house posts, standing inside homes and supporting the roof. Other poles, known as house frontal poles, are placed outside homes, showing the status and wealth of the family. Memorial poles are erected to honor a deceased person, often with a potlatch, a ceremonial feast. Mortuary poles contain the ashes or remains of a deceased person in a compartment at the top. Ridicule poles, also called shame poles, are erected to shame individuals or groups for unpaid debts or misdeed. Totem poles are not religious objects, but they play a crucial role in transmitting cultural values and histories. The art of totem pole carving is handed down through generations with elders teaching young people the craft. The wood used for totem poles is usually cedar, chosen for its straight grain and resistance to decay. Before carving, the tree is felled in a respectful way with rituals performed to honor the spirit of the tree. The carvers use a variety of tools, including adzes, chisels, and knives to shape the wood. Once the carving is complete, the pole is painted with vibrant colors, enhancing the designs and figures. The paint traditionally comes from natural sources like charcoal, clay, and crushed shell. Each pole is a labor of intense effort, often taking months or even years to complete. The erection of a new pole is a big event with community members gathering for a ceremony. Totem poles have faced challenges, including cultural misunderstanding and laws restricting indigenous practices. However, in recent years, there has been a resurgence in totem pole carving, reflecting a reclamation of indigenous cultures. Understanding totem poles helps us to appreciate the rich history and living culture of indigenous people in the Pacific Northwest.